today uh, I would like to introduce uh, several beautiful, exotic, and highly expressive uh, traditional Chinese winds instrument to you. Uh, in addition to that, uh, there is also a short concert uh, excerpt of my own composition showing you how they are employed in the traditional Chinese orchestra. Stay tuned. Uh, today, I have two winds players from the orchestra to join me for this filming. Uh, Hansen, uh, Hansen is a flute player from the orchestra, but sometimes uh, he has to uh, double some other instruments, uh, costume, uh, which he is going to show us. Hello, Hansen. Hello, everyone. And Rick, Rick is a sauna player uh, in the orchestra, and uh, Rick is going to show us uh, uh, several kinds of sauna plus a very uh, Asian instrument called guan. Hello, Rick. Hello, everyone. I'm Rick. <laughs> okay. At uh, first, uh, I'm going to talk about uh, xun. Uh, actually, uh, all the instruments I am going to introduce to you today uh, can take you back to to a very remote Asian China. Uh, xun is a very very old instrument uh, made of. Uh, uh, Clay, and also it is a vessel-shaped uh, 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 instrument. Um, you can you can play one or two notes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, uh, Hansen's uh, shun has ten holes, but the very old shun uh, has only two or even uh, three holes. So. Uh, Hansen's shun can almost give us, uh, you know, a complete uh, scale, right? Okay, you have a scale, right? Okay, yeah. uh, and sometimes um, shun in the uh, traditional Chinese orchestras, the tune, the shun play almost uh, have a very strong relation to uh, uh, departure of our loved one or. Um, uh, and also, uh, Xun also um, was employed in uh, in in the Tang Dynasty, uh, the court music. And now, right now, uh, Hansen is going to play us play for us a very short tune uh, on the Xun to let you listen to it. <laughs> I guarantee that uh, after you listen to uh, to this melody, especially several notes, uh, Hanson uh, uh, interpretate uh, imitate uh, a lady's cry. Like, woo, woo, woo. <laughs> Sometimes it's just, this is the basic uh, 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 playing technique uh, on the tune. Okay, now uh, let me go to the sauna, uh, but. Okay, let us talk about uh, sauna. Sauna, actually, a lot of um, musicologists uh, uh, thinks uh, sauna uh, came from uh, Central Asia uh, or some Arabic country, and uh, people brought sauna to China uh, through the Silk Road. Okay, and now um, Rick, right now, uh, has a very traditional. Uh, sauna, very simple, uh, only you know hole 
uh, finger hold, okay? And uh, such a kind of uh, sauna uh, always uh, employed in the uh, traditional Chinese orchestras, especially for music, uh, fest music about festivals, uh, 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 about ceremony, very happy. And okay, now he can, he is going to play us also a very short tune uh, in this style. people's talking, right? He can also imitate on sauna, uh, uh, sound like uh, people um, crying or birds singing, right? <laughs> that? This is traditional sauna, okay? Uh, very simple, has no fingering mechanic at all. Now, uh, this, this instrument looks look like a Western oval, right? <laughs> and uh, have a lot of uh, fingering mechanics. Uh, it's called auto sauna. Uh, so uh, that means uh, the range is a little bit lower than, than the traditional sauna. popular tune in Taiwan. A lot of uh, 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 young music lovers must know this tune. So um, the alto sauna sounds very close to Western oboe yes. or maybe the alto saxophone, right? <laughs> but um, sauna is a double reed instrument. Saxophone or carnet in, in, in Western countries is a single reed instrument. Ah, okay, the last instrument Rick is going to show us, ah, oh, this is a very special, also a very old instrument, like a xun, called guan, or uh, people, some, some other people call guan zhi. Uh, this is also a very simple instrument, has uh, it's only finger hole, double reed. Uh, in Tang Dynasty, the court music, this instrument is very, very important. Uh, this instrument and the mouth organ to, together are two most important instruments in Tang Dynasty card music orchestras. Now, a lot of uh, lip bending, uh, the bending notes uh, pro produced by, uh, by the lip the pressures, right? <laughs> and, uh, now, the tunes go up, so, right? Uh, the pitch go up, right? Uh, so uh, this is also a very uh, common uh, technique when you play uh, the guanzi. Uh, so, both uh, Guanzhi and Xun uh, always uh, depicts uh, the soulness uh, 
of some uh, uh, family members, <laughs> right? A very, very uh, sad music. Exotic, uh, beautiful, and unusual sound, right? Uh, if you like my video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Uh, for all my subscribers in Taiwan, don't forget to watch the rebroadcast of this concert on the classical classical music channel on this coming Sunday at 4:30 afternoon. See you there.